I gave up cable TV a couple of years ago for the Roku player. This is a Wi-Fi device which allows me to watch streaming Netflix on my TV. There's some really interesting jazz programming on Netflix streaming of three varieties, documentaries, performances, and dramatic films that are about fictional jazz musicians. The documentaries include such classics as Jazz on a Summer's Day, which was shot at the Newport Jazz Festival in 1958, A Great Day in Harlem, about the classic photograph, which was also taken in 1958, and a fascinating Charles Mingus documentary, Triumph of the Underdog. I can also highly recommend Art Pepper, Notes from a Jazz Survivor, a 1982 documentary from filmmaker Don McGuinn. Art Pepper was a superb alto player whose torturous life is told here in his own words. He was a very articulate fellow with a self-depreciating wit. I never met Art or heard him live, but this film gives us a very strong indication of his musical prowess and his brutal honesty. My favorite documentary that I've seen on Netflix so far is Willie Smith, Willie the Lion, which tells the story of the remarkable pianist and composer, Willie the Lion Smith. Heard out jazz music, they say it comes from different cities and different states. I say jazz comes from anywhere that the human being has a soul and has a heart. Billy Taylor, who appears in this documentary, once told me that next to Art Tatum, Willie the Lion had the most chops of any pianist he knew. The man had a fascinating life and after I watched this well-produced film, I jumped over to iTunes and downloaded some of his music, which I've really been enjoying lately. Tomorrow I'll focus on some of the performance video available on Netflix streaming.